Hi, I'm Dimitri Metzelton and in this video I want to show you how to connect a Mackie product to an iPad or an iPhone using the Apple Camera Kit. This works with our USB microphones like the EM91CU, the EMUSB, the Carbon, the Chromium, but also the Profix V3 mixers and the Big Knob Studio and Studio Plus. It does not work with our Onyx artist and producer interfaces. We first need the original Apple Lightning to Camera Kit. This provides a USB connector, a lightning connector for power and a lightning cable. Next, I connect the USB cable from my Mackie device, in this case a Chromium, to the Apple Camera Kit. Then I connect the lightning cable to my iOS device, in this case an iPad. Of course, this also works with an iPhone. At the time of recording, I'm using iOS 14.4. Then I enable monitoring so I can hear the return signal through my Mackie device and then I level up my signal. 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, yeah, yeah, 1, 2. When doing this, the level on the iOS device should always be fully turned up. In this next example, we show how to connect an iPad to a Mackie Pro FX V3 mixer. The Pro FX V3 mixers and the Big Knob Studio Plus interface offer multiple outputs. Using a multi-track program, I can select the single outputs. Then, all you have to do is to select the right recording track, record enable this one and you're ready to go. And with our Mackie Control Universal Pro, you even can control programs like Steinberg's Cubasis on the iPad or iPhone. After connecting the MCU Pro via the Apple Camera Kit, select MIDI port 1 for input and output in Cubasis. The iPad should be powered via the Apple Camera Kit. Thanks for watching and if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and a subscription to this channel.